The approach of CCI has been one of the key factors for its success, an approach focused on people within a holistic and open-minded view of safety and security issues. These factors, together with the high level of competence of the participants and a very good organization and communication, led to a natural and very pleasant flow of the different activities. The result is perfectly visible in the high quality of the products. The toolkits are extremely well designed and will be an important support for practitioners. In recent years, a lot of theory has been developed about safety and security. CCI has perfectly put into practice the most recent theoretical indications. Working with, you, with all of you has been a real pleasure. Considering my experience in the advisory board during the CCI project, I really appreciate the attention devoted to the contextualized feature of local place and of local crime prevention strategies. Moving from, from the search of universal solution and among them on, on the technological one to more human-centered solution and as a consequence more local tailored solution. And I was uh, luckily to take part in the, uh, well, the advisory board of the project, which well is of course very nice because you can follow up on the project from a short distance. And uh, I have to say I have been involved in quite a number of European projects, but when compared, I think the Cutting Crime Impact Project has been one of my favorites. And I don't say this because I'm being interviewed, but I really think uh, it was a, a perfect project in the sense that uh, many concrete products and instruments were, well, well were uh, gathered together and th that, that came out of the CCI project. So it was, as far as I'm concerned, a concrete a project with, with, with very good products. And in my opinion, uh, many of those products can really be used to at least try to reduce crime and the fear of crime at a European level. I think they were quite professional when, 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 when they were presented during the final uh, conference in Brussels uh, at the end of November. So the, the, the thing I like most about the project, I think that's called drive. Drive from all the participants and partners to make it a success uh, under very difficult, of course, COVID-19 circumstances. So I, I was quite surprised how, how, how well the, the project at the final end was managed and, and, and which came out of it. And then, well, finally, I have to say the work being done by, let's call them the leaders of the project, Andrew Wooten and Caroline Davy. well, it was more than perfect. So I would say to them, a great job being done. And um, I really enjoyed working with uh, you on uh, the CCI project. CCI provided security policy makers with a full package of important lessons. If I have to choose one, that would be the knowledge that should be acquired anyway, that security issues are complex rather than difficult. Abraham Maslow once said that if you only have a hammer, all your problems will be nails. CCI can show to policy makers how security problems can be approached and tackled in a more efficient way and efficiency means better results with the same or even less efforts. CCI outputs represent the, then a set of tools that any security advisor should be provided with. My humble opinion, the most important lesson learned during the CCI project is to invest more attention and more resources to human-centered solutions that are sensitive to local context. Rather than looking for more secure and safer public spaces, we should perhaps explore um, adequate ways to ensure a minimum standard of urban security acceptable for all the components of civil society, above all women, elderly, young people and minorities. Okay, I think this is a good question. Uh, I, I myself, I, I am a policy maker within the Dutch Ministry of Justice, so I, I well, I know quite a lot about translating uh, projects into policies and practice and um, the first thing I noticed about the CCI project that that it is really worthwhile investing wisely in crime prevention. Uh, the projects really showed off on, on that way. 
So again, uh, in my opinion, the CCI came out with many concrete examples how innovative and crime prevention programs can really make a difference and contributing to a reducing crime and, and making European countries more safe. And I don't say this because these are nice words, because, well, I, I have quite some experience working in the field of, of policy making. And I really think uh, that the, the products that came out of the project can, can, can make a difference. So I will advise policymakers to really uh, make use of the products that came out of it, uh, because there is evidence on what works in crime prevention. And again, the products and the program shows that it's not, this is not always rocket science. So sometimes some of those measures and innovations can quite easily be uh, implemented.